Yeah, we're in my nursery. I haven't taken you guys in here yet because I want to organize it and I keep changing it around. <laughs> but I'm trying to organize this little house again. And I don't think you guys have seen this, but Piper keeps playing with it. So anyway, so we've got, this is my garbage from my baby I painted. This is little... This is, Piper, say happy Sunday. Happy Sunday. So this is Paxton. Should we show everyone Paxton? By Melody Hess. He's so cute. He's gonna go get some hair. Mm -hmm. He's a cuddle baby, so I just finished him. Yeah. Uh, and I will be doing more. So if anyone's interested, send me an email. Let's not play with the paints. We're not gonna play with the paints. We can go play in your room. And then this baby, I have to gonna fix a little bit she's really gray so I'm gonna fix her but this is kind of like I've got my setup but I keep getting boxes of kits and I'm trying to get it all organized so I have like a good flow going I've got to put those on the wall I've got to get some of this out of here we've got a little Aussie and we've got a little Piper and this is the trundle bed, not trundle bed, Murphy bed that actually comes down and folds back up. I'm getting close to, I mean, this is kind of, this is kind of a nursery. That's not my nursery, it's my studio. So when this goes up, this crib goes over there. I wasn't going to film, but I just thought I'd turn the camera on. And then we've got little Chloe over here. And here's Miss Piper. This is... Oh, I'm going to do a little powder uh, changing video. I made a little community post saying that I wanted to have some more content besides box opening. So, so we're going to attach this to this video. And yeah. yeah, that's what's happening. So I have, this is what's happening on, I have this tripod here, but I've got a, I have, I'm going to start using my camera so I can, like, so this isn't backwards. You know what I mean? So that, this is what I'm filming, Ron, right now, this tripod. But I'm going to really, I'm going to try my camera. So, and then I just have these bins that have some clothes. I've got the diapers that go home with the dolls. I've got these empty little containers that I'm going to put some clothes in. I got those at Target. Aren't those cute? Look. Soft. She's soft. So those are just empty containers I got at Target, but aren't they cute? And I can fit clothes and everything in them and pack them, pack the babies like that. And it goes all the way up here, so let me zoom out a little bit. And I've got those up on the top I'm using to put babies in. I got those at Joanna's Fabrics, and those are perfect. They're the large, I forget, I'll link them in the description, but they're perfect for putting dolls and all their goodies in it and I'm just like over the moon with them. I've got some other stuff in there. I mean it's like it's a great room but I have and I got a TV and then I've got these little bins I got at Target too so I just have some diapers. There's another a kit up there. Like I'm trying to figure out how to how to organize this. I've just got some tchotchkes. I got some little dolls uh, up here. So we're just trying to figure this out. And then here's my desk, which has, so, so this, I gotta move, I think I'm gonna move that. These are all my silicone paints uh, there and in there are for the Reborns. So like, I've got the space, but I could always use more space. You know what I mean? It looks a mess right now. I just finished painting another baby, so I need to organize a little bit, but oh my goodness. Yeah, trying to get organized is uh, it's a challenge. Oh, there's my fridge. What's in there? <laughs> Let's see. Should we see what's in the fridge? Cheese, peanut butter, yum. There's a headless baby. <laughs> this is bo the body Paxton was going to go on, but it's a little too big, so I had to order him a newborn. This is a Reggie Dolls cuddle baby. So this one I will definitely use for someone in the future, but yes. There's that. 
Okay. Piper went to the park with Jeff, so I'm gonna go in here and show you what I what I changed up a little bit. So I got some pictures. Aren't those cute? I got them at Walgreens. You just put your picture in and it it's like sticks. It's so cool. And here's the room. So I put the bed back up. I'm out of breath. Oh my god. I've been running around. There, don't, don't mind the baby in the oven. <laughs> oh my God. I totally forgot. I'm not going to edit this out either. Okay. So Piper knows when I paint, you know, some, some of the babies will have to go in the oven, right? She made me put one in there. So that's what happened. Anyway, so here it is. So I, I've got these two munchkins in here. Um, what I did was I moved that from over here so I'll just show you so I put my because I'm painting mostly um, silicone right now but I do want to paint some vinyl also and I do have one I'm actually painting uh, vinyl piper by Andrea Arcello for a customer so I put all my vinyl supplies I still have to organize a little bit but it's this is just a toolbox I actually saw it on a it has my paints in there on a, like a makeup channel. And she uses these to store her makeup. And I was like, oh my gosh, that would be perfect. So I got that and it's, a, it's perfect. There's little Miss Piper Poo waiting for her, her glamour shots. <laughs> and uh, there's, well, this is everything you already saw. We've got the diapers and the clothes. And that's my oven. Again, disregard the baby who's in it. <laughs> this is actually a convection oven for restaurants and it fits big babies and it's amazing. I have my little sign. There used to be a big boat in there when we bought the house. And so I put my a sign. And this is one of my very first uh, reborns. This is a Wendy Graham baby, and I have had this doll for four years. Are you all proud of me? Four years. She stays in there. She's not going anywhere. She's just one of those special, special babies. It's Levi by Bonnie Brown and painted by Wendy Graham. And then I have my little chair, height chair thing here that I put some of the dolls in. I actually have the silicone babies in our room, and I'm going to do a separate video with them. But I wanted to show you the nursery. I mean the studio. So in here there's just a little cuddle baby. Um, this is just this this bed, the Murphy bed was not in here, and so of course they're coming back right now. So this was these were shelves. So it's kind of being a catch-all right now, but you know, one day at a time. I've got vinyl piper. And here's Aussie. Piper was painted by Sylvia's Creations. She is the Piper sculpt by Andrea Arcello. Uh, if you guys don't know, Andrea did a portrait baby of Piper. So this is the vinyl version and the silicone is the one you're gonna see in the video. And then my little Aussie by Priscilla Lopez, painted by Natalia Skylar, who is just my favorite. Or I just love her work, she's amazing. And then these are Jan, I wanna say, Shuckle Fort, I think is how you, I can't remember. I'll put her info below. But she makes these super adorable dolls. And Susan Gibbs, actually. It's her fault that now I'm, like, obsessed with them. But <laughs> so I have these two, and I have a little baby one. They're, they're not cheap, so. That's why I just have a couple. They're just, I love them. They're so cool. And then I organize this a little bit. I've got my computer here. And then this leaves up some much more space. So, so this, what's happening? Oh, there's a baby, naked baby. Uh, let's cover you up, Missy Moo. So I have, this is the cuddle baby that I just did. I have since put him on a body. I just had to. He's really, I'm really happy with how he turned out. He's Paxton by Melody Hess, I think I told you guys. And I have since put this is little 
Cookie by Elsie Rodriguez. I've been, I actually was trying to decide if I wanted to paint her, her or Bubbles. And now I'm thinking I want to paint her because look at that face. She's so cute. I can't stand it. So that's Cookie. And we've just got my paints. And yeah, I think it's getting there. Like I, I know where everything is. There's a lot of moving around when you're painting, especially with silicone. It just, you have to move fast because it dries so quick. So, but I'm really happy. What do you guys think? And I do, I promise you, I'm going to show, I'm going to do that silicone comparison video because uh, you guys really seem to like that video I did a couple years ago. So I'm going to do another, oh, there's the other Jan Shuckle Ford baby. I, and again, I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing her name right, right? probably not. Oh, and a little Je Jenny Lee of Weeby Babies did that little, so it's a silicone puppy. And it pees, y'all. <laughs> it's adorable. Isn't he cute? She? That's a she. So, there we go. And you'll see Piper in a second. All right, you guys. So I'm back with Piper. I'm being all professional with my ring light here. So we'll see if it stays up and doesn't fall over. So should we powder? I just, I don't powder them very often at all, but I wanted to powder her uh, and just kind of show you how I do it. She's really not shiny, but I'm just going to do, I'm just going to do her front a little bit. And I have this brush that I love. I can't remember. S someone had this brush. I don't even remember. I've had it forever. So I've got the Just Matte. This is my favorite. Uh, by D3 Creations, and I'll put the link for everything I'm talking about that I think you guys might be interested in. I'll put the link below in the description. So we just and you don't need very much at all, and I just kind of sprinkle it on them. All right, and the br this ginormous brush just seems to get it all over, and it's so soft. Um, and I think I remember where I got this. I'll, I'll try and find the link for it. Um, and I'm just kind of dab, dab, dabbing. It's so soft that I feel comfortable, you know, doing this. Um, silicone is very durable. You might feel like it's you're gonna you're gonna break something, but it and and you sh you know as you should be very gentle with them, but it is it is very durable. So that's all we're going to do, just a little bit. Just a little bit. Pretty girl. I love her so much. Oh my goodness. So you guys haven't seen her. I've showed her like a little cameo here and there, but I'm trying to find my groove with the videos. And um, so just, you know, wanted to bring her back. So I will, this is, this is another reason I don't do changing videos very often is because it's really tricky and it takes time to dress silicone dolls, especially if they're like really soft. Uh, just because they're silicone, you do have to be careful. So, but you know, I'm going to try it. Okay. So this is actually, I've had this forever. I don't think I've put it on them maybe once from Jockety. It's one month. I think it'll fit her. It's a short sleeve romper with pink and white stripes. On it. Isn't that pretty? All right, Miss Piper Poo. Let's move my phone case. So happy uh, Saturday to you guys. I hope everyone is good. What's going on here? I don't know. They're all out of school now, so. Uh, Jacob's working full time. So our twins, we have five children and I know when I, this is, I always talk about them, but they are our lives. So we have, we have five kids, four are boys. Uh, we have a 24 year old, 22, and then the twins are 18 and they just graduated from high school. So that wasn't too hard. Uh, so they're kind of off doing their thing now until college starts um henry's not starting until january that's when he got accepted into where he's going 
He's going to Denison, and I'm so proud of him. He, she is such a chunker. Oh, my gosh. But his school starts in January, and then Jake's working full-time, and he's doing a... Uh, he got his EMT certification. I'm so proud of him while he was in high school. So he's going to do a wilderness, medical wilderness trip in, um, it's, it's a school program basically, but they, it's all medical and they go into the woods and teach medical stuff. That's all I know. <laughs> That's all I know. But he has just been, oh, he's worked so hard. He's worked so hard. And for a kid who's struggled with things that I've struggled with as far as like ADD and I'm just really proud of him and oh man my ADD is real these days Woo, that's why the painting has just been perfect well this was easy to get on I thought it was going to be much more chaotic but it wasn't look at your crazy hair all right let me hold her while I find a brush Okay, I had to go find a brush. I, she looks really cute with the crazy hair. It's so soft, you guys. It's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. <laughs> oh, pretty girl. You guys, and Andrea is still making sculpts. So if anyone's interested in a piper, let me know or contact Andrea. She is like amazing. Uh, yeah. I am, and, uh, which is really exciting, I am going to be painting, um, a Maisin by Andrea, and, uh, she doesn't sell blanks very often, so, actually, actually, she never has, so this is a pretty big deal, and I'm really excited, and, um, so if anyone is interested in Maisin, I will be painting her. Uh, I will link, I'll link Andrea's website down below with a link to Maisin. She's, she, there's a, I don't know how many are in the edition, but her babies are unbelievable. Like she's just, she's magic. So anyway, there's Miss Piper Poo. She's got her little pacifier is magnetic which I actually really like so there she is hey, bye bye aunties and uncles and everybody we love you